Dear student, welcome to my channel. Topic of this video is Generic NLP System. This is the third video on this topic of Introduction to Natural Language Processing. Now let us start. This is the block diagram of General NLP System. Initially, it is represented by a variety type of input that is accepted by the Natural Language Processing application. Some of the pre-processing techniques is carried out before main operation. This is the core block natural language processor. Here the main processing happens and output is given to the output. So variety types of output can be possible. It may be normal text output, database update, spoken response or other type of response based on the particular application. Now we will see each sub block one by one. Type input. The system receives the input through typing such as text entered via keyboard. Message input. The system receives the input in the form of textual message such as those sent via chat interface or messaging application. Speech and speech recognition. If the input is spoken rather than type, this component converts the speech into text. Now we will see the immediate pre-processing because some of the pre-processing steps may happen in the natural language block. So these are the common pre-processing technique. This component process the input text before sending it to the natural language processor block. This might involve the following techniques because every application is not following all the pre-processing steps. Depend on their scope, they will apply the particular pre-processing application. Tokenization, splitting the text into individual words or tokens. Special symbol removal, eliminating punctuation, emojis, and other non-alphanumeric characters. Stop word removal, filtering out common words that do not contribute significant meaning such as and, the, is, that is nothing but irrelevant word. Lowercase, converting all characters in the text to lowercase to maintain the uniformity. Normalization, standardizing text format such as converting number, dates and abbreviation to a consistent form. Spell correction. Correcting misspelled words to their appropriate forms. Morphological analysis. Breaks a word into meaningful units that is nothing but morphemes. For example, if unhappiness word is there, so this word is made up of un that is prefix. Happy is nothing but the basic root word that is nothing but morpheme. And any double s is the suffix gates attached. So there are two ways to break the word into the basic form that is root form, stemming and lemmatization. So stemming is a crude approach and less accurate, while lemmatization is smooth approach and is more accurate. So basic task of stemming and lemmatization is to reduce the word to their base or root form. Natural language processor, the core component that processes the input to derive meaning. This includes understanding grammar, context, semantics and more to interpret the input correctly. This include parser, semantic processor, pragmatic and discourse processor, reasoner action and response generator. Output processor. Now input is clear, pre-processing steps are clear. Now, whatever the steps included in the natural language processor are discussed in detail after the output process. Output processor. After the meaning has been interpreted by the natural language processor, this component generates the appropriate response. This might be answer and update to a database or a spoken response or another type of output based on a particular application. Answer output, the system provides direct answer to the user query in text format. Database update, the system updates a database based on the input received. Spoken response, the system provides an audible response. Other, any type of output not covered by the above categories. Now, this is the core block that is nothing but natural language processor and it is expanded here in this second figure that is a pipeline view of the components of a generic NL system. Figure 1 illustrates a generic NLP system showcasing various input and output types. Figure 2 develops into 
inner working of the NLP box from the figure 1, detailing the process like dictionary lookup, lexical substitution, part of speech assignment handled by the processor. The sequence of those processes, the methods employed and the resulting format are unique to each NLP system. That's why the NLP systems are not similar in nature. The scope is different and the objectives and output are different of the NLP system. Now we will see the latter pre-processing. This pre-processing are not required for application but required for a specific application and this is generally happen in the natural language processor block. This block. For example, dictionary lookup, which required in a semantic analysis, retrieves a word definition and their senses from a lexical database. For example, a bat, whether it is a flying mammal or a sports equipment. Lexical substitution, semantic analysis, replaces the word with synonyms or related terms from the word sense. For example, do the dog was big, the canny was large. It is nothing but synonym for the dog is canny and big is large. Part of speech syntactic analysis labels a word with their grammatical categories. For example, the quick brown fox jumps. So here the is determiner. Quick is adjective, brown is adjective, fox is noun, and jumps is verb. <coughs> Natural language processor box parser breaks down the sentence into the grammatical structure. For example, the cat sat on the mat. So here the subject is the cat verb is the set and propositional phrase is the on the mat semantic processor it interprets meaning from a par structure for example bat flies at night it identifies bat as animal and it is not a cricket bat flu is action and night is a time period pragmatic and discourse processor it considers the context and broader communication aspect for example it's called is here. It recognizes the implied request to close the window or turn up the heat. Reasoner analyzes the information to draw conclusion or make inferences. For example, John is taller than Mary and Mary is taller than Tom. So it deduces that John is the tallest. Action and response generator. It formulates appropriate output based on process information. For example, what is the weather? It generates the response like it's sunny and 75 Fahrenheit today. So these are the important blocks of the NLP that is parser, semantic processor, pragmatic and discourse processor, reasoner and action response generator. So this is all about the generic NLP system. So most of the NLP application follow this generic system to implement from start to end. Thank you.